Hello and welcome to another journey. This time we will be playing. We will, this time we will will. Sorry. Skipping our word. This time we will be, we will start a new journey, and uh, it is uh, three colon. I don't know if I pronounce it right. I have never be able to pronounce it right. Uh, anyway, so this is a favorite game from my childhood. I borrowed it a lot from an uh, acquaintance. Very much. I uh, don't know really what to say more. Uh, anyway, well, I I like this game a lot. And I like the sequels too, I never managed to finish the fourth one and I started the fifth one but then my PS2 broke down. Both of them. Which was fun! So, uh, well, I kind of decide between this one and Luna 2 first. So I decided to pick this one because I think it is shorter. Plus, the spiritual su successor is, is um, coming up, coming up soon. So I thought, oh, what the heck? I'm gonna play this stuff then. So let's start then. And what kind of name should I give him? I could give him the um, canon name, which is um, uh, T. I think it's Tires pronounced. Hmm. Oh, that's back. I usually take other names. Um. Hmm. This is probably the most difficult part. Coming up with a good name you, that you can stand. Ah, <laughs> oh, what's a good name? Yeah, some other names I also pick, but um, 
I don't know how to pronounce them when I don't want to say them uh, just in case I miss to say them wrong. Let's stick with tier. Probably easier that way. Okay. Yes. So that we don't spend several minutes and or hours uh, picking a name. Let's walk around and talk to people first. So you're Teal Sun Tear. Show me your face. <laughs> you have an excellent face, just like your father. You will be an important man like him too. I, Kasim Hasil, I guarantee it. What's the matter, Tyr? Are you nervous? Don't worry, the audience will be finished quickly. Excuse me. <coughs> Just be the way you always are. The Emperor is stern, but there is nothing to be afraid of. Master Teal, Master Tyr, the Emperor will receive you now. Please come this way. Yes or no, I will not make up over 100 voices. Because that's impossible for me. <coughs> Tio McDowell, General of the Imperial Army and his son Tio McDowell. Here for an audience with the Emperor. Welcome Tio, how are things? Much as they were when we fought together in the War of Succession, Your Highness. Impressive words! Do you not agree, Windy? Indeed, uh, they are the words of a great general. Theo, I am sure you are aware of the troubling activity in the north. Would you be willing to travel the there to protect the border? Our dispute with the United City-States of Joestone are complicated, but with General McDowell short, we can rest assured. My below sword Prak has brought me luck in co on countless occasions. I would like you to have it. Take it with you. <coughs> Thank you, Your Highness. I, Theo, swear not to disappoint you. You have my blessings. Good luck, Theo. So you are Theo's boy Tyr. Quite an impressive little uh, countenance. Listen Tyr, would you be willing to give uh, the Empire a helping ha hand while your father is protecting the northern border? <laughs> I don't wanna! Yes, your highness. You can't uh, refuse. No point in trying. You already resemble your father. I shall look forward to seeing you grow into manhood. Thank you for your kind words, Your Highness. Commander Cress of the Imperial Guard will be Master Tears Superior. What an attractive young man you are! Good luck to you, Tear. Uh. Drink the danger. We have better. We had better get me going, Your Highness. I am relying on you, Teo, and Teo, I hope your effort will surpass your father's. Let's go. Does he say anything new? 
Ah, Theo, it looks like you have brought a fine son, son into the world. I envy you. You are embarrassing me, Cassim. <laughs> Look at the reflection. <laughs> Something is wrong with it. This is Cress cr cr uh, room. You will be reported to him starting tomorrow. Go and introduce yourself. <laughs> so you are Teal's boy. What's your name? Teal? I could care less if you are the son of a great general. You will get no special treatment here. Understand? Now go home. Work begins tomorrow. Report here first thing in the morning. I'm not gonna do that. Did you introduce yourself? I must admit I'm quite surprised that you have been assigned to such a weakling. But, well, let's get going. Grevia must be very sick. Welcome home, young master. Uh, how did it go? Was everything okay? Were you nervous in front of the emperor? I was so worried, but I guess everything went fine. You shouldn't worry so much, Gremio. Oh, Master Teo, I didn't notice you at all. Didn't notice me? Good grief, the only one you seem to care about is Tear. Sorry, Master Teo. By the way, young master, Teddy's here to congratulate you. My god, this dude is you! <laughs> I heard the news, Tear. You met the Emperor? Had you met the Emperor, didn't you? Tell me all about it, please. Let's go off to your room, okay? Tell me all about the Emperor right now. Ted Jones enters. Let's talk to Raldus. Hello? Uh, he's sleeping. Uh, scare or leave him alone? Ah, let's leave him alone. Ah, Gamio, where's my supper? Hey, it's most young master. Back already? How was your audience with the Emperor? Young master, how many times do I have to tell you? Please knock before entering the room of a lady. Oh well, you can be forgiven if it's my room, I suppose. But how was your audience with the Emperor? Were you nervous? You must be tired after such a long day. Why don't you go to your room and rest? I think I will take another nap before supper. Young Master, you must be tired too. Hop off the nap before supper. My hands are full right now. This is the most important step when you're making a stew. I'm not gonna be mean to him. Leave him alone. Dinner will be ready soon. Please rest in your room until I call. Ow. Please let me join your, join your entourage. I also much to Master Teo, who adopted me when I was an orphan. I want to return the favor, okay? <coughs> of course. Great! I knew you were a good friend. Now for a more important matter. What kind of man was the Emperor? And tell me about Windy, the court mag magician. Was she beautiful? Come on, tell me everything! I see. 
I'm sure you would like to... I, I'm sure I would like to see Wind in person. Hey, Tyr. I really don't know how to tell you this, but... Um... <laughs> Say, Tyr, there's something I want to tell you. Can you keep a secret? Can you promise not to tell anyone what I am about to tell you? Young Master! Ted! Supper's ready! Hey, it's time to eat! Let's go, Tyr. We can talk to him another time. <laughs> Are the glasses filled? Attention, everyone! Everybody! Tomorrow morning, I must travel north. There will be... Tyr will be responsible... <coughs> Excuse me. about that. <laughs> Tyr will be responsible for the household in my absence. I would like you all to give him full support. <coughs> Grêmio? Uh, yes, sir! You have taken care of Tyr since he was a baby. Thank for your efforts. He's grown into a fun youth. I'm grateful to you. But sir, I this is my job, uh, and besides, serving young master is a pleasure for me too. I'm glad to hear it. I hope you continue to watch over him. Cleo, Pan, I'm counting on you two as well to help and protect. Yes, Master Theo. Of course, sir. Leave it to us. <coughs> and Ted, I hope you will always be a good friend of Tear. I would do so even if you said otherwise, sir. Right here? Enough talk. Let's eat before the food gets cold. Let's raise, uh, let's raise our glasses. To my son. To the Empire. At least you pot me first. It looks like I won't be seeing your face for a while, dear. Shall I wake him up? No, let him sleep. It's not as if we will never meet again. Grimio, take good care of him, won't you? I will, Master Teal. Oh, did I wake you up? Good morning. Listen, young master. Uh, master Tio departed while you were sleeping. You are such a late sleeper. Uh, you are su such a late sleeper. Today you start working as a member of the Imperial Forces. You must prepare to visit Commander Cress. Grimmy Jones. Yay! So the next time we have a day off... Hey, here he comes! You're late yet, my young master. It's your, it's your first day on the job. I'm so excited! Whether it's battling bandits on the Mount Saifu, uh, Seifu, or monsters on Lake Toran, Pan here is your man. Calm down, will you? All you ever think about is fighting. Our job is to protect young master. I know, I know. No, let, let's be on our way to the palace. Ted, are you coming? Oh, please, let me sleep just a little longer. Fine, I'll leave you though. See if I care. Hey, wait for me, Ted! How can you leave me behind? You know you will be lonely without me right here! <laughs> There's gonna be a lot of reading for me! <clears throat> okay! They said, head to the work! I'm not gonna do that. I'm gonna go earn money! 
Um, let's save first. <clears throat> my, my, what are you doing here? If you want to rest, go home. Or is there some uh, reason you can't? Have you been picking on the Grammy again? Dave. I need to uh... <clears throat> ah, it looks good. This one? Okay. Let's hope that it will work again now. <coughs> there is some... a bit of a sheet here. Where it uh, ends up in the same spot. So, you should do the same here now. Yep. <laughs> so, I'm gonna. I think it is... I don't know if it is as long as I don't leave the map. Let's not leave the map. <laughs> Let's stick around and... Uh... do this uh, a few times just to be sure that I have the money to buy stuff. I don't know if I should dare to do the 10,000. If only it was this easy to win money in, in real life.
quickest way would be to actually do this a few times and memorize each time, but I have very bad memory. I don't want to do that. I think I'm gonna do that when I reach 10,000, I will um, save state uh, or something just in case uh, they decide to screw me over. You never know. I think also this um, uh, trick uh, won't work later in the game, if I remember right. I'm not too sure, but I think it's um, possible it start stops working. Let's now... Can I save state? <laughs> 10,000 bits! Don't have to go and work for the Emperor! I'm gonna take it up to 50, just to be sure that I have enough. <laughs> I already have enough, but what the hell. <laughs> also, another thing I remember that you can do before actually starting the game and I'm gonna try and do that uh, it's not gonna be easy let's uh... Oh, 
I think that is enough. Thank you. And uh, let's head to Armory. Probably did something dumb. Yes, I probably did. Let's save, because we're going to do a little bit of leveling up. <clears throat> because there is a rune you can get the, this early in the game, and I'm going to try and get it. Let's grind around here. Come on. Montus! Hello? Thank you. Can I upgrade my weapons? I think I can down here. I'm worried. 
I hope I didn't buy any worthless weapon that I already need to replace. <laughs> Pointed hat. Brass armor. Okay. We need pointed hats, or else we will get balloons. And I, I'm not too sure what the balloons do. I don't remember. Even more? Okay. Uh, what can she replace? I'm almost broke again! No, wait. I can't get the rune now. I just remembered. In order to get that uh, rune in the beginning, you, I think you only need to go there with Tyr and Ted. I have too many characters right now. <laughs> it just hit me. Oh, damn.
Okay. Let's just take free will then. Hey! Probably need to buy some toxins. Um, there. Oh. Bye. I shouldn't have too much problem in the next area, I hope. So it's Theo's boy. You're late. You can't be pampered all your life, you know. Sorry, I was earning money. Now for your first assignment. Listen carefully, because I will only tell you once. North east of Greg Minister lies the um, Magician's Island. Lechnatasir lives there. North east of Greg Minister. Okay, I don't know. She has uh, been commissioned to look into the stars. Go there and bring me her results. Are you listening? Tell me the magician's island is. <laughs> At least you can understand what I am saying. <laughs> Here is the rest of your instructions. There is no boat to magician's island, but I have arranged a dr for a dragon knight for a from the knights of the dragon den to take you there. You will find it in front of the barn. Ah! Sorry about that. By the way, Lechna the Seer is the younger sister of court magician Burundi, so you better behave yourself. Mm. Gee, I was looking forward to your f first job, and it turn out, turns out to be an uh, errand. As if you we were, were kids. I was hoping for something really exciting. Take it easy, Pan. Besides, the astrological results are very important for the Empire. It's not such a bad assignment. You are right, and uh, this job won't be uh, and this job won't be so dangerous. Oh, I don't mean to imply that you are not reliable, Master Tyr, but Hey Tyr, we get to ride a dragon and meet a real dr dragon knight! Dragon eyes are really cool. Come on, let's get going. Okay, how do you guys think a dragon sound like in uh, this world? Like elephants. <clears throat> are you the Imperial Guard? I'm Fush, apprentice uh, Dragon Knight, and this is my Dragon Black. Hey Black, introduce yourself! 
Isn't he cute? We will be going to Magician's Island. Black will take you there in no time. You're the Dragon Knight? You're just a punk! What did you say? You are a punk yourself! I'm a punk? I happen to be 300 years! Alright, that's enough. Let's be on your, our way. Let go me, Grimio! He called me a punk! Oh boy, this is gonna be some trip. Take it easy first. We Let's get going. Okay, okay, everybody cl climb aboard the basket on the black back. Are you ready? Hold on tight or you will you will fall off. Not that I mind if one of you did fall off. Hey! Watch it! Quite quit fighting in the basket. Okay, black, let's go. Why elephant sounds? Here we are. Speed make speed make you make, make you dizzy. Well, my job ends here. I will wait here until you're done. Be careful. Mm, I don't think there's anything important here. Oh, no. Let's continue. Two steps in. Well, I caught a fur fur. Fur fur. <laughs> Should be a Chester? No. No, no Chester. Oh, chest, chest. Medicine. to gain one more level because there is a boss fight coming up. Yeah, now I should be hopefully fine. There's the coat. <laughs> I don't think I can give it to anyone. I mean... Yep. Let's uh, cure. I don't need to cure anyone. Okay.
How unusual to have visitors on this island. I must prepare an appropriate uh, welcome. Wind rune. Wow, you guys are really something, beating my magic like that. I'm impressed, Imperial Guards. Hey, have you got something against us or what? Take it easy, I know who you, who you guys are. You come to see Lady Lechner, right? I just wanted to test you. I guess you are the real thing. Come, come this way, honored guests. stairs Does she have an elevator? I hope the door is locked when I get up See if there isn't anything important to pick up. No, there isn't. I was expecting you, Messenger of the Empire. Oh my, what a cute messenger we have this year. t is cute here. How do you feel about that? I'm sorry, you are a soldier of the Empire. I shouldn't call you cute. Shouldn't call you cute. I have prepared the astral conclusion. Follow me. Young master, we must go to the Lady Lechness. Imperial Messenger, here are the astral conclusions. Please take them. What's your name? I see. T. Such a friendly name. I am an astrological magician. My job is to see the future in the stars. But the future is not unchangeable. All I can see is the overall flow in, of things. T, you're bearing a, f a huge burden in the flow of destiny. You will have to make painful choices and experience a great deal of pain and sorrow. And I know uh, not that what, and I know not what the outcome is. But always remember that your destiny is in your own hands. Never forget that. You must decide what is right. Do you understand? Here are the astral conclusions. My job is now done, but we will meet again. Not that I see our reunion in the stars, it's just my wish. You're back at last! You sure took a time! What were you up to in there, eh? If you don't hurry, Foot will get impatient and leave us behind. Let's get going! Don't be so rude to Lady Lechnet. Are you hungry or something? Shut up! You all must be bored. I will have Luke take you to the shore. Luke? I'm here, Lady Lechnet. Take Tyr and his companions to the shore. And none of your tricks now, do you hear? Of course not, ma'am. I would never trick anyone. 
If you will excuse us, Lady Legnet, we'll be on our way. You. Yes? Your job is to, pro is to protect here. Take this. It should come in handy sometime. Fire crystal acquired! We got magic! See? Remember what I told you. Ready, everyone? Then close your eyes. Wind rune, show your power! Boy, are they late. Hey, Black, think we should leave? The Imperial Guard should be able to fend for themselves. What the? Whoa, what's going on here? We are back here already? I've never seen such magic. You are a worthy apprentice of the Lady ne Legnet. That's all fine, but... Where's Ted? Owls, what did you punk? Better watch your mouth. Enough is enough. I'm sick of all this fighting. It's about time. Hurry up and hop out or we will leave you behind. We are aboard. Darn is crowding in here. Okay, Black, let's fly back to the Imperial Capital. That's the end of my job. You all have to, you all have to deliver the astral conclusion to the M commander. While I am, while I am in the capital, I might as well take a look around. How would you like to go to, uh, how would you like to go to the theater, Black? <laughs> they get dragged to the theater. That would be fun to see. Finally back, eh? I was being sick of waiting for you. Hurry up and give me the astral conclusions. Guess you're done your job. You're apparently not totally useless. Now get ready for the next assignment. What's the matter? Why don't you look happier? It's an honor to be able to work for the Empire. Commander Cross is right! Uh huh. Listen carefully. East of Greg Minister, you will find a town called Rockland. Yeah. Understand? Rockland, east of Greg Minister. For some reason, the town, ha town have failed to pay its taxes. For some reason, they won't pay. So you will go to Rockland? That's right, you will go to Rockland. And tell them that a tax payment is overdue. Tell them they are overdue! Shut up! Stop yapping while I'm talking! That's right, all of you stop yapping! Idiot! Cannon! I'm telling you to shut up! Who, me? Forget it. Anyway, ask the military commander of Rockland about the tax situation. His name is Grady, and you will take Cannon with you on the mission. <laughs> Listen up, all of you! I'm your superior in the Imperial Guard. Disobey me means disobeying the Empire. Keep that in mind. What a creep. That's all I have to say. Now get on your way to Rockland. Cannon follows. Ugh.
We're not gonna get there right away because I got a rune that I need to attach. Thinking about earning some more money. Because money runs out pretty <coughs> fast in this world. One hundred. Damn, I lost it. Let's take it. Uh, well, same as before. I'm not too sure how much I should get, um, but I'm getting another character in a bit, so... And they will be needed to grind some before I feel safe to... Oh, I lost my frame there. Let's take this uh, and I can do another few more times later. Hey, who are you fellows? This is Monster Greatest Ma Mansion. Mansion. You are not allowed in here. What do you want? What did you say? I'm Kanan, assistant on the Imperial Guard Commander Crest. Tell Grady to come out here. What? 
Yes, sir. Right away. Please wait a moment. <coughs> what is it? Those villagers come to complain again? Get them out of here. No, sir. They say they are the Imperial Guard. Whatever they are, I'm busy. Hurry up and... What? Imperial Guard? Did you say Imperial Guard? Why didn't you tell me sooner, you fool? <coughs> welcome, welcome, members of the Imperial Guard. What brings you to this poor country town? Please come in. <laughs> Look like it. Looks like you're doing very well here. Oh no, not at all, sir. Forget it. You know why we are here, don't you? Indeed, sir. About the taxes, right? We have been in trouble about that too. You see, some bad is set up on nearby Mount Seifu and have been pillaging the local villagers. That's why we have been unable to collect taxes and deliver them to you. But I'm glad there's nothing to be worried about now. What do you mean by that? I speak of course of your arrival, the arrival of the courageous National Guard. Getting rid of country bandits will be an easy task for you. You are not afraid of them, I'm sure. Oh, of course not! Mm, bandits... Um, I'm well... We should be okay, we will cross them like flies, ho ho ho! That's ridiculous. Our mission is to... <laughs> I can't wait! I've been waiting for a good fight! Me too! Let's teach those bandits a lesson right here! Of course. Young master, we mustn't. Boys will be boys. Fine, let's get going. Don't fall back now. I'm glad of your decision, but do you know where Mount Safer is? Shut up! I'm about to ask you! Mount Safe is east of Rockland. Fine, now let's go! <coughs> I'm away, kids. Finally, Mount Seifu. All of you don't chicken up because of the bandits. And you too. Here we go! Pon, you take the lead. Why me? You shut up and go. I am the leader and so I go last. Fah. This is exciting, isn't it, dear? Ted, please don't say such things. Young master, don't put yourself in danger. I, Grammy, will be protecting you. Hey, let's go! And... Another pointed hat! That's the way I need to go, so... Oh! Boots! Medicine! Who can use boots? I started to get a lot of stuff. Uh, 
that in that. Lots of ways to pick. In there. Antique. Bing. Uh, yeah. You can appraise it uh, later uh, in the next town. I probably should uh, go back to Rockland just to get the back and uh, not um, uh, just to get my health back a bit. I don't wait. Wait. Oh, let's head back. Ah, nah. Let's continue in the. Oh, escape telephone. Ah, oh, then I don't need to head back. Leggings. Bandits. I'm lately getting worried about my inventory getting full. It's full. <laughs> okay, let's uh, think about this. I can't pick up anything else now. Oh, wait, what items? Can 
I? No. Let's head back and get rid of some stuff. Okay, let's... those things. And that... I'm gonna head down to the other town here and... appraise that thing I got, if possible. Probably sell some medicines too because I don't think I need that many. Okay, appraiser, appraiser. Oh, I can head in there and buy another escape talisman. You don't have one. Okay, let's sell this one. Uh, we can sell. Uh, let's keep that. Um. Oh. Okay, defense. Thirty six, thirty five, thirty seven, twenty five, thirty three. Hmm. I guess she. Could get the defense one. What? Oh, I maybe I can. Oh, there's a lot I have forgotten since last play it. Doesn't seem like there is an appraiser here, so maybe in Greg Minister? Okay, no? Let's head there.
I could probably do this later, but um, I want to get rid of some stuff so that I can get more stuff. Okay, appraiser, appraiser, there. A boss. Could you buy runes? I'm gonna check if you can buy runes. So I can buy one. Oh, I can't buy one. Damn it! That sucks. Another escape talisman and uh, be on our way to continue the story. Sorry if I'm not speaking so much. I'm not so sure what to say sometimes. Hello, miss.
Damn, she's powerful! We will never beat her! At this rate, we will get wiped out! Fools! What are you saying? You must protect me! Young master, let's run! I will protect you! I don't know if you can make it. Do something! Tear, everybody, stand back. I have an idea. Okay, Dad. Let me handle this. Did I, did I ever let you down? What the hell? Ted, how did you do that? Sorry, but I can't explain right now. T, I will tell you when we get home, but don't ask now. Anyway, let's get rid of the bandits and go back to Greg Minister. Hmm, this must be what Commander Kress was talking about. Oh, God. This isn't a good thing. On the rune piece. That one I think yeah, you can attach on the weapon. I don't know who it will be the best to attach to. Well, we will see. Play point! Bandits! So let's cure. And I will be right back. I'm back. <clears throat> Sup? Well, well, we have visitors. How unusual. What do you want? <clears throat> Listen up, you bandits. I, Cannon, Assistant Commander of the Imperial Guard of the Golden Emperor Barbosa, have be come here to teach you a lesson. Turn yourself in, you tax thieves. Did you hear that? He says we are a tax thieves. 
Listen here, you petty clerk. I am workers of Vervin Act. I am workers that Vervin Act. Sidonia, you introduce yourself to. <laughs> Why bother? Affable fellow. Anyway, that there is a uh, marksman Sidonia. You imperial tax robbers better get out of here before you get hurt. I'm the renowned imperial hero! Shut up, don't you join in the games. Listen, bandit, if you don't give yourself in, you will be sorry. You wanna fight? Fellas, go get them. Whoa! These guys are serious! What are you doing? Hurry up and fight! Fight! Coward. You guys are hopeless. I will take you on myself. Sidonia, give me a hand. <coughs> oh, I'm gonna deal with you yourself. Hey, help me. <laughs> give me a moment. I need a... Cough drop. I'm gonna... <coughs> We're taking it until I... We're finishing it. Give up? Haha! <laughs> Are you right, young master? <laughs> this is what you get for defying me! You didn't do a thing. Damn, how can I be defeated by Imperial dogs? <laughs> Capture the bandits! Okay, our work is done. Let's get the hell out of here. Oh, I didn't need an escape telephone. Phew, that idiot sure looked moves fast on the way down. Hurry up, all of you! We are off uh, to a hero's welcome in Rockland. Ha <laughs> ha! You are mother my shame, booty little rat. Who the hell are you? Beat it, get away.
Big Brother, are you an Imperial Army soldier? You are not, are you? I knew it because it didn't hit me. I saw them, I saw them. It's true, the bandits have returned to Mount Seifu for Seifu in the east. That's where they are hiding out. A deep well. Conversation prohibited. <laughs> what the hell was that? Welcome back, Master Cannon. What happened with the bandits? What? You captured them? I will get Master Grady right away. Please wait a moment. <laughs> You're back so soon. I'm, be I'm very impressed, Imperial Guardsman. You didn't wait any time capturing the tax trees. Um, actually, I did. I went to Lennon Camp and the uh, Greg Minister and uh, some other things. But, uh, whatever you say. What do you mean, tax chief? You are a tax chief. We will place him in the in this dungeon here. Master Cannon? What? Please take this. A small gift with, uh, from the villagers. Well, thank you very much. 10,000 bits! Yes! This is dangerous, I will hunt on to this. 10,000 bits stolen. Thanks to my efforts, the bandits have been captured. Let's head back, get back to Greg Minister. I want to report my success to Commander Crash right away. <laughs> what an asshole. Um, also, let's see. <laughs> yeah, it might be obvious. He will be soon leave the party, so. and attach that thing right away. That way would be gone. Well, let's see. Oh. Just remember we lose another one. Let's sell, sell that one stuff. We can do that in land and camp. Ugh. Also, ugh. Girl, we'll be heading uh, down here later anyway, but uh, I'm gonna do that now. Runes. Ah! Oh!
Oh, maybe it was the second game where that was possible. Rune Fragment Thunder. Now he will do lightning damage as well. <laughs> empty, empty, okay. More medicine? Yeah. This is a forest so you have to come. I will report to Commander Kras. You can all go home and rest. I'm such a nice guy. Raymark. Yeah, so nice it makes me cry. He's planning to take all the credits for himself. Let it go, Pan. It wasn't much of a big compliment, com accomplishment anyway. I'm exhausted. I want to go home and rest. Young Master, we have been away from home for a long time. I will fix something uh, special to eat. Great, Gremio. Gremio, your cooking is ter terrific. Dad, you come with me. What's this about? Oh, nothing much. It will be over soon. Come along now. Okay then. Here, go on home. I will see you later. Besides, I have something to tell you. Let's go, Ted. Finally, home sweet home. Young master, I will prepare some food right away. Unstuffed. Sure beats the dry meat we have been eating. Find us some food fit for our humans. <laughs> what are you talking about? You would eat anything to fill your stomach. You got a pointer. <laughs> Young master, I have made some tea. Ted's late. He said he will be back right away. The stew's getting cold. Young master, it's kind of disturbing, isn't it? How so many, pe many people are saying bad things about the M Imperial Army. You're right. Compared to the days when we won the war succession, the army's reputation had gone down the drain. That's because of shady characters like Crest and Cannon are do doing whatever they like. Young master, you must miss your father. <laughs> hmm. Ah, Cleo's here, so I'm fine. Young master, where did you learn such language? Come on, was it you? Uh, I don't think it was anything wrong with it. Maybe it was, uh, but I'm missing the context. I don't know. Oh god! <sighs> Young master, what in the. Pan! Cleo! Pan! Give me us a hand! Ted, what happened? All this blood and this wound! It's not natural! Magic? What are you doing? Bring him in immediately! Young master, give us a hand!
Ready? Put your hands on my shoulder and hee ho! What happened? Was he attacked by thugs on his way back from the palace? But then, why would he have a magic wound? He's coming around. Uh, oh, where am I? Where are they? The Imperial Guard aren't they here yet? Help me, Tyr. Relax, everything is fine. Tell us what happened after you called down. Grimio, I... Hurry up, will you? I'm starving! Keep quiet and wait. Commander Crash is seeing Lady Windy now. Alright, Ed, follow me. Okay, okay. It's been a while, hasn't it, little man? You haven't changed a bit in 300 years. I'm envious. You... You're that witch! Well, now, you remember me, don't you? Do you? That pleases me. Of course, you have never left my mind for a moment. Now give me that rune you have on your right hand. No way! I would rather... What are you doing? It's a curse rune! The Soul Eater! It's power! Don't be a fool! If you do that here, you will destroy yourself too! Oh, fuck it. Tear, please. Hey, Ted. He's passed out again. What is going on here? It seems the Imperial Guard are after him. But how can that happen? What are you accusing Ted of? He's a good boy. I don't know, uh, Cleo. Maybe we better contact the Imperial Guard. I think there was a typo there. Why? Your best friend will never do anything to harm the Empire. Why should we call the God? But we can't be sure. We can't cause problem while Master Theo is away, away. Well then, we wait, wait until Ted wakes up. Young Master. Ted's fever isn't getting any better. I'm going to go wake up the shopkeeper and buy some medicine. We got medicine! Pawn, we got medicine! Damn it. It won't stop raining. It's a nasty rain. Give me the shivers. Uh. He's waking up. Mmm. I'm sorry to be a bother. Forget it. What did what did you mean by soul eater? Tear, please. Will you do something for me? What is it, Ted? Tear, take off my right low. What's this? Not one of the twenty seven true runes. Yes, it is. This one is called the Soul Eater, the Curse Rune. The source of all the tr all this trouble and the reason the court magician, Windy, is after me. Why? Why Lady Windy? Why would she do such a thing? I don't know why, but uh, which wants this rune? I've been wandering the world for 300 years trying to escape from her. I never thought she would find me here. My mistake was using the rune's power at Mount Seifu. Is this what you used to blow away the Queen Ant? Tear. With this wound, I will never escape from the witch. I hate to bring friendship into this and know it will bring unhappiness. But... But... You are the only one. Please. Please protect this rune. This cursed rune must never fall into the hands of Windy. You are the only one I can entrust this to. Please take it. Please take this rune. I will take it, Ted. Don't worry. 
Thank you, Tyr. This rune may bring you suffering. If it does, blame me. But you must never, never let it fall into Windy's hands. Give me your right hand, Tyr. Change for, for scissor. Oof. 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 Sorry about that. Hit, hit my toe. Ooh. Wait a moment. I will be right back. I'm back. Sorry about that. And now I can relax. Nope. Yes. Out front. Follow me, Gremio. Yes, Cleo. Tear. For 300 years, I have never had a good night's sleep. But now I think I can. Not a good sleep for 300 years, damn. So, young Master MacDoll is here too. Give us Ted. We know he is here. <coughs> Loyal Pawn had to told us. Pawn, you? Why, Pan? How could you do this? I can't allow any trouble to happen while Master Theo's away. I can't lose his trust in me, please understand. Drag Ted out of there. I won't allow that, Crass. No one, not even a commander of the Imperial Guard can enter Master Theo's house without that just cause. That's right. I swear by my hatchet I won't let you pass. Wait! So you are giving up, huh? Tear, 
they think I still have the Soul Eater. I will be the bait while you escape. Then what about you, Ted? Alright. Young Master! With that wound, Ted will never get away! Quiet, Gremio. Young Master knows it too. But he must keep his promise to Ted by leaving, leaving right away. Right, Young Master? Hurry! I understand. Young Master, let's escape through the back of, in the kitchen, of the kitchen. <laughs> and no one suspected a thing. Thank you, Tear. In 300 years, you were my only, my only true friend. Really? In that case, damn. La 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 running in the rain, no one suspects anything. Nothing at all. Oh my! Why, aren't you the young ma the young master McDowell? What in the come on in <clears throat> What's going on here? Imperial soldiers running around while you come uh, scurrying in soaking what? What the? <clears throat> oh well, forget it. You probably can't tell me about it. Excuse me a moment. <coughs> Don't worry. You're welcome to hide out here. I will put it on your tab. Thanks. Thank you so much. Young master, we better make ourselves uh, scarce for a while. But good heavens, I never thought we would ever. I think our only alter alternative is to travel north and ask Master Tia for help. For now, we better figure out a way to escape Greg Minister. Young Master, try not to wander about. Eh, don't worry about me, I will be fine. What can happen? Nothing bad can happen at all. Nothing at all. Uh oh, I was so hungry, I just couldn't help myself. What shall we do? Whoa, ouch! What were you going, you little runt? I get, I get cold on duty. On a holiday, sent out to search for someone all night, finally find a moment to catch some rest, and you come alone! Uh... I don't know which one I should take. It doesn't really matter which one I take, but... Um... Ah! Shut up, you fool! What kind of language is that? We are Imperial soldiers, your protectors! Hey, wait a minute, you look familiar. Yo, Master, are you alright? Hey, you! Who do you think you are? Who are you? And what's this young Master business? You! Show me his face! You look like that fugitive, uh, the McDowell kid! What did you say? Any more of a fuss and we any more of a fuss and we are in big trouble. Young master, get away while we hold them off. Guess we have no choice. Here we go. That's enough, young fella. You two Imperial big shots. Use your head. Would fugitives uh, in, of the, from the lobby hanging around here? They couldn't be that stupid. I suppose you're right. We just want to be wanted to be sure. Stop it! You're scaring them. Leave it to me to kick them out. Hey, wait a minute! Don't worry. There's no reason why we should be. Uh, there's no reason why we should be so loyal to the Empire. Hey, 
It's that guy! Whee! Thank you, so thank you very much! No big deal, I was just wondering how to pay for my meal and... You mean... You did that just to build the... Come, come, let it go, eh? Well then, thanks for helping us out. What's the matter? You look troubled. <laughs> I know who you are. That rebel McDonald killed, right? We are not rebels! I could've care less either way. Is it illusory? How do we plan to escape this place? I have an idea if you care to listen. I am used to this kind of thing. Interested? Mm, Alright, help us out. Leave it to me, but I have one condition. Here we go. It's no big deal. If you succeed in escaping, I would like you to meet someone. A small request, right? So it's a deal. Let's hurry. First, we must go to the uh, palace gate. Don't worry, I won't hand you over to the Imperials. Uh, okay. It's not the palace gate, but the city gate. And also. Buy some. Uh, let's wait until we. Well done. I will go talk to them. Just relax, relax and wait here. Everything is okay. Make sure you hide your faces. Sure is hot around here, I think I will get in the shade. Phew, we did it. I thought my heart, heart would bust. How did you do that? No big deal, I just gave a little gift. Imperial soldiers act tough, but money is a weakness. That's the, that's the state of things in the Imperial capital. Corruption is everywhere. Everything is about to come about uh, at the seams. That's too bad. Say, how did you bribe him? You just told us you had no money. Why should I use my own money to help you get away? What do you mean? What do you mean? Hey, my wallet! When did you? Here you go. Let's check it. I suggest you keep a better eye on it. And now for a little promise. You haven't forgotten, have you, little fellow? It's Master Tear! Okay, so it's Master Tear. I would like you to meet someone in Lennon Camp. Agreed? It's a promise. Fine. Now let's get out of here. Lennon Camp is the due south of here. Hey, yeah, yeah, I know, I know, I know. I've been there. Sometimes. was nothing else I could give him. Nope. 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 Here we are in London camp, Tear. Not much of a place, but they do make fine tea here. Well then, it's about time. I got to work. I got to work. Let me go make some arrangements. I may be I may be late, so take a look around. Who is this fellow that Victor wanted to meet? You know, I can't quite trust that man. I have no idea. So what shall we do now? I would love to take a shower. Let's sell uh... Robe. Oh. 
Welcome to the Teyaki uh, Inn. A bed is 70 bits per person. I will throw in breakfast. Day. To our friend of Victor's. Well then, I will prepare the best rooms we have. I guess what his name Victor never returned. But we didn't make any other plans. Let's wait a bit longer and uh, if it still doesn't show up, we'll ha we will head north. north. Perhaps Master Teal can help us. Leo, why did Pawn? Don't, Romeo. What's going on? At such a late hour? We heard there's some fugitive are staying here. We will look around. But sir, our guests are sleeping. Shut up! Do you plan to harbor rebels? Young master, they're coming for us. Victor, he must have rather ratted on us. I knew we shouldn't have trusted him. This doesn't look good. They will find us for sure. sure. What should we do, master, young master? Mm, let's run. Good idea. From the window. Here we go. <clears throat> it's jammed. Won't open. Hurry, they're coming nearer. We are in big trouble now. Grimmie, maybe we can get the master, young master out of here for... This way, hurry. Who was that? What are you waiting for? Hurry! Do you want to get caught? Who are you? Whoever it is, thank God! So you are the new friends that Victor told me about. Everyone's waiting. Follow me. Okay, let's go check them. Nothing here. Sorry, dear. You must have a uh, have had a tough time, but it was exciting, ex exciting, wasn't it? What's going on here? I didn't think I would give myself away so soon. Oh well, now you now that you have met Odessa, Odessa, that name rings a bell. You don't mean the rebel army? Rebel army. We prefer, we prefer to call ourselves the Liberation Army, but who cares about names? Let me introduce myself. I am Odessa Silverberg, leader of the Liberation Army. How do you do? Victor, are these the people you wanted us to meet? That's right. Prepare yourself for a surprise. This here is the son. Uh, this is this here is the son of General Tyr McDowell, and a fugitive to boot. Don't you think it would be a great asset to a liberation army? You got to be kidding! Why should Young Master join the rebels? Right, Young Master? Maybe I should join the liberation army. Who is this? He's interested. Interested? No way! Recently, many of our of our hideouts have been discovered. There must be a spy among us. For a meeting, then. With all the problems we already have, we can't afford to recruit complete strangers. I guess you all you have all been fooled by Victor as well. Whenever he takes a liking to someone, he just drags them in. But they do appear to be hunted by the Imperials, and the town's still full of soldiers. You may stay until things blow over. Whatever decision you make afterwards is up to yourself. You got to be kidding, master, young master. 
Join the rebels? No way! Rebels? Liberation Army? Well, why not? Maybe we should become true rebels. On the other hand, what we must tell of things? See what's down here. I don't think there is anything. Nope. Let's up top here. Doom, 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 doom. Hoi. Uh, are you alright? I must tell Lady Odessa. Let's take him inside. Where are we? Don't worry, this is the Liberation Army hideout. Have you a message for me? You must be Odessa, thank goodness. I am one of uh, I am one of the Mount Seifu bandits, but we only attack those rotten Imperials. Anyway, the other day, the Imperial Guards came over and uh, captured our bosses, Varkas and Sidonia. Varkas and Sidonia? Could they be? Shh, be quiet. They do Odessa, please help Varkas and Sidonia. That rotten Grady of Rockland has strung them up to starve to death. Outrageous! Execution without trial? Even by imperial law, that's illegal. How awful! But Odessa, imperial surveillance has been intense lately. We have to keep a low profile. I'm aware, I'm a, I am aware that we are understaffed. But the bandits have asked for our help. We can't let them down. It's our fault. What do you mean it's not your fault? We... <clears throat> I see. Well, even if you didn't know what you were doing, you still have to claim responsibility, right here? You must rescue workers in Sidonia. I will help you too. I agree. I don't plan to betray the Empire, but Grady is unforgivable. You're right. Undoing Grady's wrong would be good for the Empire. Besides, if your master gives the order, I will follow. Thank you. Orcas and Sidonia are strung up by the, uh, at the home of Rockland's military commander. If you don't hurry, they will dry out. Up. Please help them. Here, I beg of you too. Victor, you go too. Leave it to Victor! Let's get going, Tyr! Rockland, here we come! <coughs> Let's upgrade him a bit. to change post getting a bit stiff And um, weapons, uh, not weapon armor. Up 
Ang <laughs> Dave, because I haven't done that in a bit. So I get the, my magic back. Who are you? You have no business here. Get out, or you will be strung up like those bandits. Ha! <laughs> hmm. The key is pretty tight. Uh, it, it will be tough sneaking in. Leave it to me. I'm used to things like this. Help! Help! The greatest merchant is on fire! 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 What? Victor! What have you done? You didn't? do anything it must be the dry weather my goodness your master don't you dare take after someone like this yes dad um how did he put this on fire while the guy was looking this way uh ah, must be the dry weather oh Need to change a bit. Otherwise, Victor can't attack. Medicine. Hello. Damn it! <laughs> Could have saved some money.
Another antique. But I don't think I can... Uh, uh, press it for a while. Why don't you hit? Thank you. Now I don't need to kill yet. Oh, what's going on? I can see. My god, it's your Imperials! Why are you here? Have you come to laugh at me? <laughs> of course not! If we known what sort of fellow Grady was, we never would have helped him. A few things happened and now we are wanted by the Imperials, just like you. We'll help you out. Thanks, get my body down the... Uh, get my body too, will you? Whoop! Heh, <laughs> not necessary. Sidonia, why you? If you got tricks like that, why didn't you escape sooner? <laughs> Can't very well escape alone. Sidonia, you? <laughs> hey, let's get over here. Well, you could have teleported out of that and helped him and escaped. You could just have maybe jumped here or something. And again, uh, maybe he's got so uh, dried out uh, here so that uh, he d didn't have the strength to pull over, unless there's a lot of people around. Who knows? <laughs> you! You dare to turn against the Emperor, free the bandits, and even, even set my house on fire? You will be sorry! So you want to fight? Don't think you are the only one with a grudge. Why? I will cut off your eyeballs. What? Oh well. <laughs> I would rather tear him to pieces. Oh please. Well, you see, you will regret this. I will tell Master Cross about this. You will be. You will get yours. Cleo, do you think the Empire will take us back? I don't know. Your master. <laughs> don't worry. There, there is all kinds of ways to make a living. Yeah, Marco is down there. I guess we all deliberate our army of lies. Tell Lady Odessa that if you, she ever needs help, Marcus and Sidonia will be there in a flash. Well, we are off. Perhaps we will meet again. <laughs> it sure is great to be done. Let's go back to the Lennon camp. Tyr, why don't you spend a bit more time with the Liberation Army? Come on! Young Master, when we return to Lennon camp, let's decide what, uh, what to do. At this rate... Uh, there is no... Nope, there was none. Okay.
So slow to walk. I can't wait until I get the ability to run. T, you're back. Thank God. Our problems are sold. What do you mean? Odessa, you're not planning to... Yes, I am. What? What? What's going on? T, take a look at this. What's this? Show me. What's this? Plans for a fire spear. Fire spear? Right. The Liberation Army may be tiny now, but Sunday will be big enough to meet the Imperials head on. When that day arrives, the Fire Spear will come in handy. We spent good money for this uh, at the Dwarf Mines. See, this blueprint must be reach our must reach our secret factory, but we can't leave this hideout un unattended. I would like you to take on this assignment. Enough! Don't you understand what you, that we are members of the Imperial Army? How can you expect us to betray them? Let's go, your, ma go, your master. No need to stay here any longer. Wait. Do you have any idea what the Empire is really doing? Do you know what the people want? Or will you pretend to ignore all that? Gremio, you saw with your own eyes, heard with your own ears. Are you willing to ignore the truth despite all you see and hear? What about your tear? Do you still want to return to the Empire and continue to bring back those little boy? My father goes his way, my I go mine. Just a, wait a, just a moment, young master. Talk like that and you will never re on the Imperials. Don't you care? Come on, Cleo, talk to him. I will go. I go where young master goes. My job is to protect him. Those are those are orders I received from Master Teal. Teal, let me explain. This is a blueprint for a fire spear. It has to be delivered to the Imperial Army Secret Factory. Northwest of Lena Cramp, across the river lies Mount Tiger Wolf. Over the mountain is a village called Saradi. Someone uh, from the factory will meet us, uh, you there. Odessa, I just don't get it. Why do you insist on this guy? He may be an Imperial spy. Yet you want to give him the blueprints for something that could sh change the destiny of the Liberation Army? Don't worry, I'm going too. What? If you're going, I'm going too. Bleak, if, uh, if you come along, who's going to protect this place? It's about time you begin acting like a leader. Don't worry, Flick. I will protect Odessa if you promise to protect this hideout. It is settled. To Mount Tiger Wolf, then. If any, uh, if any arm comes to Odessa, you will be sorry. Mount Tiger Wolf is northwest from here, across the river. Saradi Ligi lies uh, uh, past the mountain.
The sun is beginning to set. Do you think we can cross the mountain before dark? I don't want to spend the night out in the open. In any case, we have to go up. Let's go. Darklet. Who can equip that? Oh, that's I can, but um, I'm not gonna give her anything because she is a temporary member. Snail A chase poster again. Loves. Killer bonus. Can I burn all? Can I? No. Damn it. Might as well do this then. Wind room piece. I guess uh, Cleo might be the good one for that one. Karate uniform! Okay, um, I think, I think. Yep, here. Let's give uh, this one to him. And this one. There. Equip. Limes! Yay! What would an RPG be with those slimes? Should probably sell some stuff when I get back to. When I get to the city. If possible. Welcome travelers, coming up at such a late hour, you are, you have a really got guts. But you better stop here and continue tomorrow. It's dangerous around here, uh, what with all the bandits and all. Why don't you spend the night here? Sorry, we are in a hurry. Great idea, my feet are killing me. For once, I am in agreement with you. I'm not sure I can go on. Me too. I don't think we can refuse. That's it then. Say, old man, do you have any tea? Of course, sir. Come this way. Oh well. well that's a I guess we have no choice but to spend the night here. 
To tell you the truth, my feet are killing me too. Excuse me, why don't you have some of this uh, this before supper? It's a special tea from uh, Mount Tiger Wolf. Let's give it a taste. Ugh, it's pretty bitter. Very bitter. Here's some for you too. Uh, I can't refuse. Just a taste, done. Here you go, but be careful, it's very hot. Hmm, smells kinda funny, doesn't it? Say, old man, what's this tea called? It's a special Mount Tiger Wolf brew called Robert Tea. That's a weird... <laughs> My god, this is... Hey, you, what have you called? <sighs> Damn, such a old ch <laughs> Everyone's asleep, thanks to the drug tea of Mount Tiger Wolf. <laughs> wow! For a bunch of stragglers, these guys are loaded. Looks like we are we will be living uh, the good life for a while. Hey, Lidon, how have you been? Doing well for yourself, I see. Why, it's boss, it's boss Kessler. Welcome, welcome. As you see, I had just pulled the job. And a fine-looking woman in this the bunch, too. Wait a minute. This here is... Lidon, what have you done, you fool? What do you mean? Do you know who this is? You're some stupid travelers, I should think. Idiot! Even an ignomate. Ign ignomate. Ign ignomate. Damn! Even an. Ign ignoramus. Even an ignoramus like you must have heard of Lady Odessa of the Liberation Armors Army. Well, of course, boss. Even, even kid knows who Lady Odessa is. You don't mean that this here is. Yes, I do! Hurry up and prepare an antidote! <laughs> uh, let's see, a rabbit tail, rose leaves, a handful of sugar... Leiden, if anything happens to Lady Odessa, you can say goodbye to your head. <laughs> Yikes! Rose tail, sugar leaf, handful of rabbits! Forgive me, Lady Odessa. Without the weight, I nearly committed my life's, gra my life's greatest error. If you like, I will make a lead on here pay for this. Please, sir, spare my head. Don't be ridiculous. I will have to be more careful from now on. Maybe I don't trust people too much, like Flick says. I have no way to of a, a poor guy, Sam, but please stay here for the night. I will do what I can to, uh, uh, by way of uh, hos hospitality. But no more poison, you hear? <laughs> what kind of snoring is that? I'm going to give up serving poison tea. I have learned my lesson. Are you a member of the Liberation Army too? I see, so you're not. Lady Des is a true heroine. She is serious about overthrowing the Empire. There are many who express discontent, but only she means to do something about it. I hate the Empire too, but I'm, I am just a bandit. Lady Odessa is our hope for freedom. Just rub my neck a bit. <sighs> Good morning, young master. You up early, too, dear? 
Hey Gamble, why is Cleo in such a bad mood? Don't bother her, Victor. Cleo is always always in a bad mood when she wakes up. I see everyone's here. Today we reach the ready. Leaving already? I will unlock the door. Antique. Clone crystal. That's a um, good one. I think I remember. But... Clone attack. I'm gonna give it to Victor when I can. We are supposed to meet as messenger from the secret factory at, the, at an inn in, the, in this town. Where could it be? It's a small town. We will find it soon. Let's uh, look around a bit first. Hey, heard the latest? They say that Odessa, the leader of the Liberation Army, is a 9 foot giant. I don't think uh, she is. Not a big town, so let's um, sell some stuff. She is just a temporary member. Anything to buy? Water crystal! We need one of those. This must be the inn. Let's run to some room and wait for a messenger, me the messenger. What? Customers? Goodness! It's been years! Rooms will cost you 50 bits each. Day. Must be a boring job to work at an inn and uh, not getting any customers for several years. T, can't you sleep? Me neither. But the night breeze makes me feel better. Can I tell you something? 
What is it? Kessler of Mount to Tiger Wolf, Bleak, Humphrey, Sandshire. They all expect so much from of me. But sometimes I feel like running away. I'm not sure I'm worthy of their, their hopes. What do you plan to do? Will you return to the Empire? I don't understand. Use your head. You have the ability to judge right from wrong. Your father is a great general of the Empire. Perhaps you will be able to return to a peaceful life. But remember that you can't turn away from what you see and what, how, what you feel. Because if you do, that's a sin. You are strange. I feel compassion when I'm with you. I suppose Victor brought you to us because he felt a special quality in you. There are many in the Liberation Army. Humphrey, Sanchez, Mose, and Fleek. But nobody has eyes like yours. Eyes that draw people to you. Many people. If I should ever... Who is it? My name is Kage. I've been sent by Sir Mose, the chief of the secret factory. Mose certainly keeps you unusual company. How is he? I received a letter from him to mention that a pigeon of him is was sick. I find it hard to imagine Mose taking care of a sick pigeon. Very strange, lady. Sir Mose do does not keep any pigeons. I am sorry. I was just testing you. I never betray a, betray a contract. This is a blueprint for a, for a fire spear. Please deliver this. The future of the liberation movement depends on it. Understood. I will go now. It's getting late. Tea, we better rest. I don't wanna. What do you mean our job is done? We finished our business last night, didn't we, T? Come to think of it, young ma your master's bed was empty in the middle of the night. Y young monster, what were you up to? Something you can't tell me? Come, let's go. get going, T. Young monster! Let's go, Gamil. Nothing strange happened. We were just talking and a ninja showed up. Nothing to worry about. Just gonna quickly stretch my legs. We'll be right back.
I'm back. Let's head back to Lennon camp. I also can face the mountain we can teleport. At least. Wait a while until that happens. Not really too sure where I will end the stream, but at the moment I don't feel like it. So I'm gonna do it till I might manage to do go all the way, way until I reach get the base. Which is not really too long on then. Depending on uh, how you see it. Depends on how much I will be running around like a fool. I can. Uh... Yep, I can. Take that one. Take that one. And then attach that wind thing to Cleo. Uh, 
Anything else I can do right now? No. Hope I can you uh, phrase something soon. There was some wasn't anything up there? Nope. Oh no! What happened? Are you all right? The Imperials is suddenly. I'm sorry, Lady Odessa. My God! Hey, Odessa! Let's go after them, young master. Let's get some XP. They are strong. What was that? Let's hurry! Right to Dessa? Come, you can come out now. Quickly, you must run. Uh, okay. <laughs> Did you, Dessa? You're bleeding. Odessa, what have you done without you, the Liberation Army? I'm so sorry, Victor. It appears I have chosen to be a woman rather than a commander of the Liberation Army. I couldn't let a child die. I'm a failure as a leader. Don't talk, Odessa. You will open your wound. Will you come here? I have two requests. First, give this earring to a fellow called Matthew in the village of Seika. Stop it, Odessa! I don't want to hear any final requests! Victor, thank you, but I know the end is near. Tear, take it. My other request, please throw my body into the stream there. What? But why? I can't do such a horrible thing. Please, dear. As a wish. Tear, how can you? Thank you, Tear. You understand me, don't you? Victor. If the Liberation Forces find out I'm dead, 
the moment we lose faith and die. That is why you must keep my death a secret. Our tiny newborn ho hope must be kept alive. If you ever see Fleek again, tell him, him that his kindness always saw me through hard times. Well, it appears that end is near. Tear, I hope that you will be able to see the free world that I was never able to. Goodbye, Odessa. I suppose we go, should go. I suppose we should go to Seika. Yes, let's and find let and find this fellow Ma Matthew. Matthew, is it Matthew? Son of a 